The Xtol S1 probably has to be one of the most accurate diode lasers I have ever used. And if you caught my recent review video, I did a deep dive on every feature that this has along with a lot of engraving and cutting test. In that video, there is a feature that I rushed through that the S1 has, and that is the new twin positioning method. So in this video, I want to give you a short tutorial and show you how this works. Now, Axtol says it's more accurate than a camera when it comes to lining up your image to be engraved. And I would say, I think they may be right. Check out this short tutorial. Now I am going to show you guys how to use the twin positioning method. This is a mini spoon that I have in the engraving bed. So if you go to the Creative Space software and click Start Marking, it says move the laser module to the top left. So what we're going to do here is to move this, I'd say right about there. And, I, and I don't, I'm not sure if you can see the arrow there. So now that we got that, we are going to click the power button on the front of the S1 and it's marked. Now for Vertex 2, we are going to move this and click the power button again. And now it is completely done. And what you will see here is a little box, and this is the complete processing area. How cool is this? So we want to make sure everything fits in this box. And look here. This just engraved inside of the processing area that we told it to. The advantages of using this is that it is crazy accurate. There's no more guesswork or messing up. You guys can see that this new twin point positioning works really well. And I'll be honest with you guys, I really wanted the camera. It is hard to go back to manual positioning after you get used to using a camera with a laser, but I have really been enjoying using the twin point positioning on this laser, and I am getting some accurate laser engravings because of it. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to bring you this short video and to say, hey, if you are in the market for a laser engraver, I proudly recommend the Xtool S1. This one is checking off all my boxes for me currently. So anyway, if you would like to check out this laser, I will post an affiliate link below. This will help support my channel at no extra cost to you. And if you haven't caught the review video of this, my gosh, guys, go watch it. I spent like, I think 53 hours on that video between filming and editing. I put my life into it. So anyway, I know you guys may not be worried about that, but go check out that video if you haven't. Comment any questions you have below. I'll see you guys later.